As the 4th of July holiday approaches, Iowa's rivers and lakes will be flooded with boaters, kayakers, and swimmers. With more people out on the water, it's important to keep safety in mind. At Honey Creek Resort in Moravia, instructors make sure guests are prepared to get on the water. Um, initially, you know, you have to have a good fitting life jacket. That's pretty important, especially when you're out in something that you haven't been out in. Uh, we teach them how to use, you know, their whole body when they kayak as opposed to just their arms because you don't want people tiring out. Um, and just teach people to kind of be calm and, you know, uh, keep their weight low so that you don't tip the kayaks while you're out there. Now, once you know how to get in and out of the boat safely, your biggest concern while on the water is not tipping over. When they tip, uh, they're built in such a way that you actually fall out of them. You're not trapped in them, you're not stuck in them. They don't have the waterproof skirts that go around them as some of the sea kayaks do. So you actually just kind of, as you tip, you roll out of it. Um, what we do is we just you know, tell them to swim to shore if we're close enough. Otherwise, the instructor kayaks have tow ropes and we can tow them in and a little sump to get their kayak dry and then we get them right back out. Most important when waters are busy is being cautious around other boaters and being mindful and attentive to your surroundings. We are kind of the pedestrians of the waterway, so we technically are supposed to have right of way. We don't know how many boats know that, so we just kind of give them a wide berth and you know stay as far away as we can. Um, and we try not to impact you know people that are fishing. We try to give them their own space too. So as long as everybody kind of stays out of everybody else's way, it's usually fine. Summer is a great time to take advantage of Iowa's parks and lakes, so stay safe and have fun. Reporting in Moravia, Kate Alt, KTVO News.